Med valves locked. ECS reduced for launch. Roger. Status check. Go Atlas. Go Centaur. Fifteen. This is Atlas Mission Control at T minus ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, five, four, three. Atlas engine ignition, zero, and liftoff of the United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket carrying OTV-1 for the United States Air Force. Vehicles cleared down with me. Listen in to Marty Malinowski providing the launch vehicle ascent data throughout this flight. Vehicle pitch program has begun. Vehicle body rates look good. Tank pressures are stable. Continues to operate well. Which problem's complete? We're now flying the zero angle attack phase of flight. Booster PU has gone to closed loop control. Engine response looks good. Pump speeds are stable. Injector pressures are good. Range track looks good as we've now passed through Max or Mach 1. Max Q, boosters throttled back right on schedule. Correction, boosters now throttled back on schedule. Previous comment was booster PU going to closed loop control. Current altitude is 11, 13 and a half miles. Downrange distance is 8 miles. Current velocity is 2,136 miles per hour. Start out with propulsion and hydraulic securing. We've done alpha bias steering phase of flight. And CEC system securing. Vehicle body rates look very good. Coming up on closed loop steering enable. And steering has been enabled. Vehicle response looks as expected. Go ahead. Bus and battery voltages are good. RCS pyro valve has been fired. And we've begun to throttle to maintain two and a half G's for payload fairing jettison. Current altitude is 37 miles. Downrange distance is 36 miles. Current velocity is 4,082 miles per hour. Range track shows the vehicle progressing well right down the middle of the corridor. Continuing to hold 2.5 G acceleration levels. Engine response looks good. Next event will be payload train jettison in about 20 seconds. And we have payload ferry jettison. And CFR jettison has occurred. We're now throttling back up. Engine response looks good. Boost phase cooldown has begun. Boost phase cooldown's been completed. And we have Biko.
We have retros and stage separation. We have locks and fuel pre-start. GN2 purge firing is underway. We have ignition and full thrust on the RL-10. This is Atlas Mission Control at L plus five minutes, two seconds into the flight. And as you just heard Marty Malinowski report the successful execution of the events comprising the early parts of this evening's mission. And all systems continue to operate nominally. Uh, the flight is going as planned with the payload fearing jettison uh, event and booster engine cutoff and then Centaur main engine start, uh, each occurring as planned.